collaboration is absolutely critical because this is not about competing with each other to get your slice of the cake. It's about increasing the size of the cake that everybody benefits from. I think it's really important uh, for people just to, a, to get a sense of what's happening in other parts of the world and how they have maximised the opportunity. You know, we'll not all get the opportunity to go and travel to New Zealand, so you know, bringing a little bit of New Zealand here to tell their story is, is very helpful. Northern Ireland's on kind of a tipping point and it's about to just rocket off. I think it's going to go, yeah, the next few years are going to be great in tourism. So push the boundaries on innovation and push the boundaries on how you market the region to the world. We're very lucky, we've got fantastic locations. I mean, you'll see behind me some wonderful views and, and not just wonderful in the sense of beautiful, but quite striking, you know, quite uh, original looking locations. This will last a very long time. And we looked towards the model of the Lord of the Rings in New Zealand and saw the longevity that they had created in telling their story. We go to this place in, in Northern Ireland and it's like, it actually looks like we're in Game of Thrones. They just are that epic, the locations. Yeah, and it's like, whoa. Yeah. It's like, this is why they used it. It's like, you, you really get it when you walk there. Yeah. Winter is coming, you know, but the tourists are coming. You know, they are going to be coming here. They're going to want to see these filming locations. They've all got to stay somewhere. They've all got to eat. Now, increasingly, there are more and more films and TV shows being produced in Northern Ireland. And that's on the back of, really, this big show that's been filmed here for the last 10 years. I think the big message is that Game of Thrones is here to stay for a while. And it is the biggest TV show in the world at the moment. What a gift to have.